Good evening and welcome back to Digital Assets Daily. Tonight we're going to discuss VeChain. VeChain announces Foodgates, a cross-continental blockchain logistics solution. It was showcased to French and Chinese heads of state. VeChain has announced it will team up with ASI Group together with existing partner DNV GL on an initiative to enable food tracking on the blockchain called Floodgates. It is powered by the VeChain Thor public blockchain and is the first such solution of its kind. Uh, I'll let you read the rest of that if you choose to. I want to get right back into WeChat Pay using blockchain to track payments, says Binance CEO. Why does CZ care so much? Globally, companies in almost every industry are implementing blockchain solutions, so why should CZ feel the need to comment on this one? Perhaps it has something to do with a story from earlier this month, in which CZ announced the launch of payment on-ramps for Binance in China, utilizing WeChat Pay and Alipay payment services. Alipay was quick to refute the claim, saying that any payments related to cryptocurrency were banned from its services. WeChat also confirmed its anti-crypto stance, and there is no suggestion that WeChat Pay is anything other than a centralized payment system using blockchain, presumably for invoicing. But, as many of us know, VeChain, um, or WeChat, I should say, could be powered by VeChain, and we also know there have been previous experiments between VeChain and Tencent. So, VeChain is definitely doing things behind the scenes. And it's exciting to see where this goes. Uh, again, this is not financial advice. It is for entertainment purposes only. All, excuse me, all links will be included in the description below. I hope you're having a great night, and if you hold VeChain, be excited. They're doing a lot of exciting things and making a lot of new partnerships and growing behind the scenes. And I'll catch you in the next one.